Hello everybody, I'm Richard Holdner and welcome to another episode of Speed Secrets. Today we're working with the guys from Comp Cams on, you guessed it, a cam swap on an LS. But not just any LS, a carbureted LS. So why should we look at a carbureted LS? Well, there are two reasons. First of all, if you go to the wrecking yard and pick up a used LS, it's less expensive to buy a long block than it is to buy a complete motor. And for a lot of guys, it's much easier to deal with a simple carburetor system than hook up the factory or an aftermarket EFI system. The problem is, that still leaves them with a factory cam. And as we know, cam swaps are worth a lot on an LS. So let's take a look at a cam upgrade on a carbureted LS. To get things started, we grabbed a used 5.3 liter from a local wrecking yard. We installed it up on the dyno, but before running, we had to make a few upgrades. First of all, we installed a carbureted induction system. Then we installed a set of long tube headers and upgraded the factory valve springs in anticipation of the future cam swap. So let's check out those mods and get things started. We started with the Junkyard 5.3, then installed a dual plane intake and a four barrel carb, then upgraded the valve springs so she was ready for the dyno. Decent power with the stock cam. After installing the carbureted induction system, the long tube headers, and upgrading the valve springs, we ran the 5.3 liter with the stock cam. Equipped with that LM7 cam, the 5.3 liter produced 337 horsepower and 378 foot-pounds of torque. Now that we've run the stock cam, it's time for the upgrade. First we pulled the front cover. Off came the timing chain. And then the factory cam. And in with the comp cam. Now that we've got that mild comp 273 cam installed, let's see how she does. Then run once again on the dyno. A mild cam with serious power. Check out those power gains. Okay guys, the results are in. And as you can see, even though it was a mild cam, that 273 cam from comp cams improve the power output dramatically. I mean, the power jump from 337 horsepower and 378 foot-pounds all the way up to 415 horsepower and 397 foot-pounds. Those are gains of 78 horsepower and nearly 20 foot-pounds of torque. So it just goes to show you, even on a carbureted LS, the right cam makes a big difference. I'm Richard Holder, that's all the time I have. I wanna thank the guys at Comp Cams Join me next time on Speed Secrets.